moon bow The sun bear says hello to everyone oh, hello. To the clouds and the trees And to you and the bees To the stars and the moon and the sun Moon bow is your friend my banner and I am here uh, on uh, uh, Friday the 22nd of May 2020 for the new moon yeah and I am here with my friend Max say hello Max hello everyone yeah that is a nice hello so yeah it is a strange time here uh, we are in the middle of a uh, coronavirus and we are in london england yeah we are and um yeah it is such a strange time guys anyway i will talk about it later what we are doing but anyway it is new moon and new moon is is the time to set intentions yeah so as the moon gets bigger so it is now dark moon no moon in the sky you can't see it or maybe you see a very dark shadow i don't know but anyway um today it's cloudy in london we may not see anything but anyway mm, so yeah it is a time to grow intentions yeah so mix yes Mumbo. what what are your intentions oh um let's see to spend more time with animals <laughs> that is a good intention do i count <laughs> i am a sun bear but i live with you anyway you can't get away from me <laughs> oh but anyway uh yeah we will talk about the animals later anything else max what is your intention um to be explicitly thankful for all that i have oh yeah that is normally for the full moon we say about gratitude, but that is always something nice to grow. Yeah, Mix, I like your intentions. Moonbow's intentions are to say hello to everyone. Yeah, hello. That means, well, for Moonbow, that means I love you. I don't know if you know, but hello is like hello. <laughs> A delight to see you and I am even though I can't see you exactly um, the same as seeing you face to face uh, by the way I would like to say with this coronavirus and this we like to call it physical distancing not a social distancing and I will tell you why because socially in uh, relationships we are still very connected and close isn't that right, Mix? That's right, Mumbo. We're actually spending quite a bit of time uh, on different Zoom calls and things, uh, connecting with people. Yeah, so we are not socially distanced at all. I would say no to that. No. But what we don't have is nice interchanges with strangers. So that is a social distance and that is sad. I miss that. Mix! Yes, Moonbo. I miss that. I miss going about the town and saying hello to everyone. It is not so nice with masks and staying away and staying at home all the time. I mean, we have a nice time, but we go out for bicycle rides. Yeah, yeah. Moonbow rides in the basket with Roxy and we go to St. James's Park. It is very nice. And uh, But we also go outside with Roxy in the garden to play and things like that so but yeah we miss just saying hello hello yeah but we met someone on uh yesterday it, he was a dog walker he had uh four dogs with him usually he has eight or nine but he was very nice and they talked about the they talked about they meaning Max and him. I didn't say anything. I except hello. And then I played with the dogs. Okay. But uh, yeah, they were saying that it is a very good job 
Spending time with dogs? That is a good career choice. Huh? Maybe Moonbo could do that. Mix? <laughs> yes, Moonbo. Do you think I could be a dog walker? That would be such a nice career. I like that idea. I get to be out outdoors, play with dogs, say hello. Yeah. And then I could make some money and give it to, to the people with the cup. Yeah. We will talk about it later, Max. I think it is a very good idea. Moonbow the dog walker. Ha <laughs> ha! That is nice. Okay. Anyway, yeah, we missed those uh, hugs as well from our friends. So we can see them on the screen. And now in London, we are allowed to meet one person outdoors at least two meters away. But we usually do four because we are careful. But we don't get to hug. And that is not so nice. Yeah. But, but uh, we are having so many connections online. It is so nice. Max, tell them what you are doing tomorrow morning. Okay. Tomorrow morning, I'm on a Zoom call with some people I haven't necessarily met, but they've asked me to sing songs. <laughs> that is so nice. To be asked to sing songs. What could be nicer than that? That is so nice. Okay, but um, yeah, so that is what we miss. And also I want to say, well, one of the things I wanted to talk about today, guys, is about asking for help. Yeah. Mix. Yes, Moonbow. You were asking for help recently, weren't you? Yes, I was. I asked. Um, my mother for some help. Yeah. And I asked my lovely friend Aisha for help. Yeah. Aisha, who is in uh, France. Hello, Aisha. And uh, Bertrand, hello. Hello in France. Yeah. But um, yeah, Aisha, you have known her for a long time. Yes, I have. Many, many years. Yeah. That is a nice friendship lasting so long. Yeah. Mmm, that is really... Oh, I want to just sit with that. Oh, Max and Aisha. Oh, friends for so long. How old were you when you met Aisha? <laughs> I don't know. I think I was about three. I was in nursery school. Oh, little tiny Max. <laughs> That is funny. What were you like, Max? Um, I'm not sure. I think I was a bit naughty, though. <laughs> naughty Max. That is funny. And what was Aisha like? Well, I don't remember what she was like when she was three, but she was always very beautiful and very poised and very smart and super friendly and really just made everything very beautiful to be with her. Aisha? <laughs> Hopefully someday, but she does watch your show. Oh, that is nice. <laughs> Hello, Aisha. Thank you for watching my show. Okay. So, yeah, so she helped so much. Yes, she did. She helped by introducing me to a friend of hers called Chris, who was able to help me here in the UK. Oh, that is nice. Say thank you to Chris. Thank you, Chris. Yeah, thank you, Chris, from Moonbo too, because you helped Max and Max, uh, yeah, she needed some help. And also, thank you to, what is your mother's name? Janelle. Oh, thank you, Janelle, from Moonbo too, and also from Max. I know, I know that she thanks you, right, Max? Yes, deep, deep gratitude to my mother, Janelle. Yeah. Yeah, so that is a thing, guys, because some cultures, especially here in, in, in England, I would say people don't ask for help enough. They keep it to themselves and they worry about being a burden and things like that. And really, it's okay to ask for help. Yeah, it is so important. And, and when... Oh... 
when Sim died? Yes, Mungo. Well, we asked for a lot of help. Yes, we did. Over and over we asked for help. We were, oh no, here comes the sadness. Oh, it's always just there, Max. I don't know. I will maybe always, always be there. But we asked over and over and we got, you see, we got so many hugs, guys. And now if... If Sim had died now, we would not have any hugs because of coronavirus. So, in a way, we are very lucky that, uh, that he died before this coronavirus came. Because we could have a funeral, right? And, and we got lots of help and um, hugs. And now we could not. So... Oh. oh, yeah, crying. So, but I didn't know I would cry on this show, but I did want to talk about something else. You see my t-shirt? Yeah. <laughs> Max got me that. <laughs> it has a tiger with sunglasses. <laughs> it's funny. You will see me in a whole new wardrobe, but not new. Not new. Max? Yes, Moonbow. Tell them where you got the t-shirts. Well, I always buy you used t-shirts. Yeah, guys, I wear for a human being a uh, size 11 to 12 years old. <laughs> it is because of my tummy. <laughs> yeah. I'm not very tall, but I have a big tummy. So anyway, that is what I wear. And Max, tell them where you get my t-shirts. Well, before coronavirus, I would buy them at the charity shops like Oxfam or something. Yeah, that is where Max would buy them. And But now you get them on eBay. Yeah, use t-shirts on eBay. Yeah, isn't that right, Max? That's right. And uh, we have bought you a bunch of new t-shirts for this time. Yeah, like this tiger. Yeah, this is a nice one. It is cheerful and the green matches my my camouflage socks. These are Sim socks, guys. And um, and then my headband. We got that with Sim too. Uh, uh, that was last year. We were at the um, Shrewsbury Folk Festival. Yeah, anyway, um, not this year though. I don't think it can happen and not with Sim anyway, but um, I want to talk about reuse, recycle, also something else, guys, that happened today. Yeah. Max, is it okay for me to say? Say about what? About Sim and his ashes. Yeah, you can say about that. Okay, guys, so um, Sim is cremated so he has ashes and today is the new moon and we decided to spread some and um, and we spread them in the uh, potatoes we are growing and the um, rocket and the carrots and we spread them where the foxes live and we spread them all kinds of places and the, the reason I'm telling you is because that way Sim gets to go into the earth into the potatoes, into the foxes, into the worms, into the flowers, into the trees, into the water system. And he is recycled. Yeah. I don't know if this makes sense to you, but for Moonbo, it is a nice feeling that he is returning to the earth. And he will be part of the earth and making useful new life like in the soil and things um yeah max yes moonbo isn't that right that's right sweetie sim sim will continue he's with us everywhere yeah in our hearts especially max 
That's right, in our hearts, in our minds, in our bodies, and in the earth, and carrying on through the cycles of life. Yeah, and we like that. This is a very joyous thing. It's a quiet, quiet joy. Yeah. So today, some of Sim is returning to the earth, and it is a good thing. Yeah. So, but we, Max? Yes, Mungo. We are still alive, you and I, in the physical form we are alive. Uh, Sim is not alive in the physical form, but he is fully alive in every other realm, is what we say. Yeah, but anyway, so that is reuse, recycle also with us, you see? Not just plastic bottles reuse, recycle, but people and animals. Yeah, it is the way of Mother Earth. That is what we say. Yeah, yeah, okay. But what else? Yeah, what else I want to say? Um, I think this is the last thing I want to talk about today is, is, um, is about animals. <laughs> yeah, Max? Yes, Moonball. Yeah, you said your intention is to spend more time with animals, so I am going to tell them what we have been doing and maybe we can show some clips. Okay, you do that. Yeah, so we are spending time with squirrels. Oh, those squirrels, they are so cute. And um, also parakeets. Parakeets, little green ones, nice, very cute. And also with foxes. We have a new fox friend. Ha! We are going to show you some photos and videos. Yeah, okay. Uh, yeah, Walnut is our new fox friend and she is so cute. Ha! And she's so bold and she brings us such joy. And you know, what I want to say, guys, is mm, animals count, right? Not just humans, animals count. And I know I've said this before, but really, if you spend some time with animals, like uh, Moonbo, ha! hello, Moonbo, yeah, and uh, Roxy the dog, hey, Roxy, and also parakeets and squirrels and blackbirds and... Uh, uh, oh yeah, mice. We have uh, we have field mice in the garden. We see them. Yeah, them too. And the uh, the squirrels and every. It's so nice, mix. <laughs> yes, Moonbo. Yeah, you get so happy when you are with animals. It is really nice to see, and you share the joy, and that is also very nice. So anyway, so I would say to you guys, hmm, this is Moonbo's message for today. Number one, set an intention. <laughs> yeah. And uh, listen to your heart for a good intention as we grow to the full moon uh, in June. <laughs> full moon in June. <laughs> that is a funny thing. Okay. That is number one. Number two, um, ask for help. Yeah. It is so important. Your friends love you. And they will help you. Yeah, it is important. Okay. And um, gratitude to Aisha. Yeah, okay. But for you, for all of you, okay, ask for help and reuse, recycle. Yeah, because, you know, my t-shirts, like <laughs> these new t-shirts, it's kind of nice to think some other being seven or eight-year-old child wore this tiger t-shirt. Now we are connected through the shirt. I don't know who they are, but thank you very much for my shirt. Yeah. And um, yeah, I like it. I hope you liked it too. Yeah, that is good. And um, yeah, so reuse, recycle. And uh, friends, connect with friends. Yeah. And oh yeah, gratitude. I wanted Max. Yes, Moonbow. 
I forgot to say gratitude to technology for keeping us all so connected. If this coronavirus came uh, 20 years ago, then oh, it would be much harder. Yeah. Or maybe 25 years ago, 30 years ago. I don't know. A long time ago. It, if it came then, we would not have this uh, Skype and Zoom and FaceTime and 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 uh, WhatsApp and uh, uh, Microsoft Teams and uh, oh, I don't know all these things they have and it's very it's very nice. It uh, it means we can see our friends near and far. It is very good. I like it. Anyway, so stay connected, ask for help, and reuse, recycle, yeah, and spend time with animals, yeah. So I am going to finish, yeah, and sing a song uh, from Plum Village, yeah. I don't think I have sung this one, but if I have, <laughs> it is getting sung again. <laughs> Moonbo doesn't always remember what I have said and not said, but there you go. Okay, mm, here we go. I like the roses, oh, I like the daffodils, I like the mountains, I do, I like the rolling hills, I like the twinkling stars when the sun goes down. Doobity 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 I like the rabbits. <laughs> I like the squirrels too. Oh, the squirrels. I like the bluebirds. I like the roaming moose. I like all animals. All animals like me. Ha <laughs> That is a fun song. But wait, it reminded me one more thing before I go. We want to shout out to our friend Annabelle. <laughs> Annabelle has made fun nights on Zoom for us. And I have been there. And, uh, and we dress up in funny costumes and we play games. And it is so fun. So I would recommend uh, finding a way to have fun in these days because the usual ways of fun cannot happen so find a new way to have fun okay say bye bye mix bye everyone yeah bye from moonbo bye moonbo the sun bear says hello to everyone oh, hello. to the clouds and the trees and to you and the bees to the stars and the moon and the sun Happy hearted Moonbo, such joy from start to end. With fur and toes and ears and nose, Moonbo is your friend.